can we just be colored? There's a narrative about colored people that I would like to address because this is a narrative that the media tends to perpetuate. Yes, I'm about to address this issue again. Yes, I am also tired of it, but I will continue to speak on it until something changes. I've tried to understand this from both sides, ours and theirs, and wondered why we aren't a part of them, why our representation differs from theirs, why we see ourselves through different lenses from theirs, why our jaws are always clenched, why we have permanent teeth marks on our tongues from our history why our throats are raw because we have constantly had to retell our stories but have had to create our own platform to retell these stories you see because our narrative of who we are does not fit into their spectrum it does not appeal to their senses no wonder their narratives have become senseless about us they've reached a consensus a true indication of our history repeats itself so i will repeat myself until it is fully understood that yes, there are coloured people with gaps and gold teeth and rollers in their hair. Yes, there are coloured people who have fallen victim to drug abuse. Yes, there are coloured people who have formed part of gangs. Yes, there are coloured people who aren't fluent in English. Imagine judging someone for not wanting to roll their R's. Yes, there are coloured people who do not convey their words in their colonizers' language and yet you forget that that's as a result of a systemic structural problem that not all colored people have had the luxury of escaping from. And my issue isn't that the media portrays colored people in this way. My issue is that the media mostly tends to portray colored people in this way, as if that's the only narrative that exists of us for us, as if that's the only way people can differentiate between us and other races. My issue is that the portrayal of colored people is so restricted, so limited, so diminished that that is what has happened to our existence. We have become so restricted, so limited, so diminished. Now there are solutions to this as I do want this to be constructive. If you are going to interview colored people who fit into the stereotypes I mentioned above, be mindful of how you conduct your interview and of your portrayal of colored people. Yes, we do know that you edit your interviews. Secondly, be aware of how you represent us as representation has so much significance to it. Thirdly, can colored people actually represent colored people? Can we control our narrative, our identity, our existence? Can we not be reduced to stereotypes as if the only reason for our existence is for people to make fun of us? Can we just be recognized beyond the confines that have been set up for us? Can we just be colored?